Coach talked about it after the game, but you know, you guys didn't freak out. I mean, what was just kind of the message at halftime? Our motto is always DFO, don't freak out. Uh, only allowing six points and a half is very big for us. One of our goals is uh, allowing under 21 every week. So giving our offense a chance to come out there, find their rhythm, find their stride, and come out and attack the second half, it was amazing for us. Big, big plays all night from the defense. Uh, how big was Lane's interception there? Oh, it's humongous. He, he always drops him in practice, so I give him a hard time. He finally got him one, so yeah. it's always good for him. You always seem to get a few sacks. Uh, yeah. You know how good does that feel when you when you can put pressure on them? You know, uh, it's really it's really praise to the DBs for giving for giving me a chance to get out there and get that sack. So I'll praise to them. This defense just seems to be getting better and better. What's you know what's the potential for y'all? Oh, sky's the limit for us. You know we're always trying to go 16 deep every year, so yeah. I think we have a good chance of that this year. Obviously, y'all are three and zero. What do you got to do to keep it going? I think just find our stride, find a way to start fast and finish strong. I think once we bring it together, we'll, we'll be a heck of a team to play against. You guys go against Lathan in practice. Oh, yeah. Uh, how tough is he? Oh, my God. I think he'll, he'll prepare you for any back in the nation. You know, I'm going to college next year. I don't, I don't think I'm going to see a Lathan there either. So, you know, I, I love to have him. hate to play against him. Right. Cool. Thanks, Carlos. No problem. Appreciate Thanks so it. Yep. Yes,